you don't do this every day. There's not many places in the country that will have this kind of span, this kind of crossing, this kind of engineering that has to be done. And this kind of evaluation for the methodology of getting the tensioner equipment to pull this across the canyon. I mean, this is very, very unique. And a lot of people have put an incredible amount of time and effort to plan ahead, test it, mock things up, test to failure. I mean, there's been a lot involved in, in making this happen. This project is unique because it covers many terrains. It uh, goes over mountains, it goes over um, forest, grasslands, and over this canyon right behind us. Um, and it stretches about 80 miles. The distance between the two lattice structures at the, at the new crossing is, is just under 6,600 linear feet. You know, you're, you're talking about on the order of 100,000 pounds of tension um, hanging off of these lattice structures and the associated dead ends, that, dead end structures that are behind them. So the line is sprung by a special conductor called 1272 KT ACSR. It's made in Japan. And uh, today, it was strong by helicopters uh, flying across the canyon. They use a 5 16 inch rope, and it's a real high strength rope, and they flew that across with the helicopter. Once they get that 5 16 inch rope across to the north rim, they'll feed it through the, the pulling equipment and then tie it off to a 3 quarter inch rope and pull that back the other direction. That 3 quarter inch rope is, of course, has they got to step that up to get the appropriate tensile strength in order to tie that on to the uh, specialty conductor. There's a helicopter pull followed by a, a mechanical pull, tie it off to the new conductor, and then a final pull. So it's a three-step process to get each conductor and each wire across the canyon. So they'll do that five times, one for each phase and then one for both of the fiber cable. This is definitely the most unique project I've ever worked on. We've had eight years of excitement at every turn to try to get uh, to get to where we are today. We, you know, we got 60 years out of this one. We should probably get 60 years out of the next one. A lot of kudos to the to the folks that have been involved in this project for the past eight years.